Hello ladies. So <laughs> I just thought, hold on, let me get my little handle together. There we go. I just thought I would come on and do a very quick update. <sighs> I've been having the hardest time. Hold on y'all. Yeah. I've been having the hardest time trying to find the time to make a video. Um, these girls keep me really, really busy. <sighs> And I was trying to ha look halfway decent when I decided to make a video, but 99% of the time, I'm walking around the house all day in clothes like this. Just like a little gym shirt and yoga pants. <laughs> all right, so um, the girls will be three months um, on the 22nd of this month, which is less than a week away. Um, I'm just like, time is really flying by. <laughs> How am I doing? I'm doing great. Everything is well. I know in my last clip, um, which I don't even know if I'm going to include that in this video or not, but I did say that I went to um, a different doctor and got an endoscopy done and everything looked great. Um, so um, <laughs> that was basically it. They um, had me on Nexium for a couple of weeks just to kind of soothe my stomach because there was still some inflammation in, inside of my stomach. But as far as any type of issues or damage or anything um, from the sepsis, everything was great. So I'm pretty much feeling back to normal at this point. <sighs> Thank God for that. I'm really happy to start back feeling <laughs> like myself again. Um, it does make it easier to... Um, take care of the girls now um what else has been going on how are the girls doing like I said the girls are going to be three months um up next week and um let me see if I can do a little clip of the girls this is summer hold on let me just do this a different way sorry all right all right, so this is summer. I can't get this camera to work right. My little baby is juicy now. She, uh, summer is, um, I'm sure they're both over 10 pounds at this point. Let me show you Skylar. Oh, Lord, I'm out the fall. <laughs> Lord. That's my Skylar. Knocked out. All right. Back to me. The girls are doing well. Um, they went to their pediatrician a couple of weeks ago. And um, at that point, Skylar was 9 pounds, 13 ounces. Summer was 9 pounds, 7 ounces. Um, that's been over two weeks at this point. So I know that both girls are probably over 10 pounds at this point. Um, they did get their two month shots at that appointment. I survived cause Lord knows I thought I was going to lose it. Um, imagining watching my babies get a shot. <laughs> I'm such a water bag, but my husband was there. So he, um, held Skylar and I held Summer and you know they cried a little bit we picked them up right after their shot and hugged them and comforted them and they ended up just taking a nap so the next couple of days or a day or two they were kind of cranky especially if you touch around their little um, site where they got the shot but they were okay we gave them a little bit of Tylenol and they were okay so they survived and we survived. The girls are really, really doing good. They're coming into their little personalities and Summer, just as she was when I was pregnant, she was baby A and she was like the busy one, the one that would always kick me and poke me and stuff like that. She is still the little busybody of the house. We call her the boss lady. <laughs> and um, Skylar was the laid back one. She was baby B. Um, she was the laid back baby that I would always have to pull out the Doppler to see if she was alive because I just couldn't feel her because um, she was just that laid back and she's still the same way. Every now and then she'll get in her little mood and 
fuss, but that's pretty much if something is wrong, if she's hungry or whatever, but usually, y'all, I'm sorry about this thing on my head, my head wrap. I just washed my hair and it just dawned on me that I still got this wrap on. Oh Lord. So I just washed my hair and wrapped it. So that's the reason why I have this head wrap on. So sorry about all of this. I just wanted to get a video in right quick and let you ladies know that all is well. Um, what am I going to do with this channel at this point now that um, I have accomplished my goal, which is to become a mother? I don't know. Um, I don't want to stop vlogging, you know. Um, I don't know if I should do family vlogs, you know, um, vlogging life as a mother of twins. Um, I am trying to lose weight. I have uh, lost 45 pounds um, from my pre-pregnancy weight, um, and then I gained, <laughs> oh Lord, I gained 10 of those pounds, really nine, but I'm just going to round it up to 10. I gained 10 of those pounds back. Um, so really I lost 35 pounds, I guess. And I want to lose another 35 pounds within the next, um, three months. So I, I thought about doing, um, like a weight loss journey, postpartum weight loss journey. I don't know what to do with this channel at this point. I just don't want to leave it hanging and just don't do anything. You know what I mean? Um, I still want to keep in touch with you ladies and still want to, um, just encourage you guys and, you know, provide information if I can, you know, I, I, I don't know. Let me know what you think. What do you want to see from me? <laughs> That'll help me out a whole lot. Nothing or a weight loss journey or family vlogs or, um, I don't know. Just tell me in the comments, um, what you think I should do with this channel at this point. <sighs> Cause I know some, um, family vlogs can be very sensitive, you know, uh, being that a lot of the sisters are still trying to conceive and I don't want to just put babies in your face all day long. So I don't know what to do. Just let me know what you think. Um, what else was I about to say? Well, I, I'm having a brain fart <laughs> and Summer's trying to wake up. So I want to wrap the video up because I see that we're coming to the 10 minute mark. Um, I was going to say... I have another month left of my maternity leave. I've been gone from work for a long time because I don't know if you guys know, but I've been out since February and it's September. <laughs> I was out um, prior to delivering the girls because I was just getting nervous and, you know, feeling heavy in the stomach and just didn't want to take any chances. But that old tech held up and my cervix was not um opening at all so everything was was really really or shortening rather so everything worked out really well i am going to um reach out to my um which i have spoken with someone at my re's office um because they did reach out to me to see how everything went with the delivery and blah 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 with the girls so i'm gonna go by and hopefully take a picture um with my doctor dr balthazar and the girls so i want to have that for my scrapbook um am i gonna try to have any more babies i don't know i do have a few embryos left in the freezer i more than likely will have to make a decision by the end of next month because i think that's going to be my year mark from when we did the retrieval um hold on y'all my baby a little reflux all right mommy oh wait mommy All right, so, hold on. Oh, Lordy. Hold on, y'all. Hello, baby. It's hard to try to work with one hand. Hold on a second. Oh, why? Oh, why? Oh, why? Oh, why? Wipe your mouth, baby. Wipe your mouth, baby. Oh, wait. Okay. All right. So, um, sorry, y'all. Um, what was I about to say? So, yeah, I want to, hold on. I want to try and, um, 
yeah, I have to figure out at some point within the next few weeks um, what we're going to do. Obviously, if I am going to try to have more kids, it's not going to be right now with these two little beans. Isn't that white? Because they keep me extremely busy. Um, yeah, so I have to figure that out. Um, at this point, I do want to congratulate. I think I congratulated Sonika on my last video. Maybe I didn't, but I do want to congratulate Sonika on the um, delivery of little Charlie, Charlie Ann. <laughs> and I also want to congratulate, hey, mommy. Say, speak to me, mommy. She loves me talking to her. She's like always in my face. Um, I do want to congratulate uh, Nikki. Nikki just had her little baby. That's another one of our tax sisters. So I'm really excited for you um, to have gotten to this point. Um, excuse me. Um, I do want to encourage you ladies, the ladies that are still on this journey, the ladies that are um, trying for child number two or child number three. I just want to wish you all the best of luck. You know what, little one? You're doing the most, child. Hold on. All right. So, yeah, I just, I just want to encourage you ladies um, that are still on this journey. Just don't give up. You know, I know you get tired of hearing that, but it's the truth. Lord knows I've been on this journey for the longest. You know, not one year, not two years, not five years, not even 10 years, almost 15 years. And thank God I did not give up because Lord knows I can't even imagine. Look at that baby right there. Look at that baby. Oh, that smile. That mommy smile. That mommy baby. Yeah. <laughs> she loves me to talk to her. But I can't imagine what, you know, I can't even imagine if I would have given up and not been able to experience this. So... It's such a blessing to have two. You all right? It's such a blessing to have two. You know, I had it in my mind that um, just no matter what, like I just wasn't going to give up. Like I just was not going to give up. That was the desire of my heart to become a mother. So no matter what, I just kept going. So I just want to encourage you ladies just to keep going no matter what. You know, be smart about what you're doing. If you have any questions, you know, I thank God for these vlogs. Because a lot of um, of us sisters always are sharing information with with each other, and it's very helpful. Um, but I just want to encourage you guys. You know, keep going no matter what. You know, if one thing doesn't work, don't just get, throw in the towel. You know, find another way. If there's anything that I can do to ever help you, ladies, you know the routine. Send me an email. Uh, shoot me an inbox. Whatever I can do, I'm always available um, to help you, ladies. So I'm going to go because this one is awake now and I'm sure she's going to be ready to eat in a little bit and she's probably going to start fussing. So, um, like I said, let me know in the comments what you think I should do with this channel, whether it should be like a family vlog channel or, um, vlog my weight loss journey or I don't know, regardless of what I decide to do, I'm still going to pop on to provide information as I get it. If I get information, I'm going to give it to you. So that's, you know, you don't even have to say that because that's just, I'm going to always do that no matter what. But as far as I'm not going to do daily vlogs because Lord knows I can't even, I just don't have the time to do, to do that at all right now. I still, I'm still trying to get the hang of being a mom and being a wife and taking care of the girls. Um, you know, so I'm, I just can't do a daily vlog. But when I do pop on and do a vlog, just let me know what it is that you might want to see from me. <laughs> All right. All right, ladies. Take care and I will talk with you soon. Bye. Look who woke up. Yes. That's Tyler. That's, guess who woke up. Skylar woke up. Is that my Skylar baby? Is that my Skylar baby? Let's fix this camera view. Is that my Skylar? He my baby. Hi. Say hi. One, 
woke up and the other one went to sleep. This is the story of my life. She was awake during the vlog. I fed her, she went to sleep. And this one woke up. Hi, those fingers taste good. You're eating those fingers. You're eating those fingers. 